वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम फाइव डैश थर्टी फोर सो स्टेटमेंट इज द मोटर एम इज कनेक्टेड टू स्पीड रिड्यूसर सी बाय ट्यूबुलर शाफ्ट एंड कपलिंग सो यू कैन सी दिस इज अ मोटर एम एंड दिस इज स्पीड रिड्यूसर दैट आर कनेक्टेड बाय शाफ्ट एट कपलिंग एंड दिस शाफ्ट इज अ ट्यूबुलर शाफ्ट द शाफ्ट हैज़ आउटर एंड इनर डायमीटर ऑफ वन इंच एंड जीरो पॉइंट फाइव सेवन इंच सो दीज आर द डायमीटर्स इनर एंड आउटर and is made up of material having allowable sharing stress of 12 ksi so allowable sharing stress of this shaft is 12 ksi when motor supply is 20 horsepower of power determine the smallest allowable angular velocity of the shaft so you have to find the smallest velocity angular velocity of the shaft so let's start with the solution so as we know that uh, power is equal to torque into angular speed so from here we have angular velocity is equal to power divided by this torque so we have power we do not have torque so what we will do is that we know that we have been given as allowable sharing stress is equal to um t into c divided by j so we will find j for uh, this tubular shaft so j for tubular shaft is equal to pi by 2 into c not power 4 minus c i power 4 so c not is equal to d not over 2 which is equal to d not is 1 so 1 by 2 is 0.5 so we have 0.5 inch n c inner is equal to c d inner divided by 2 which is equal to 0.75 divided by 2 which is 0.375 inch so you can just put the value j is equal to pi by 2 c not is 0.5 power 4 minus c inner is 0.375 power 4 So when you calculate it, you will get J is equal to zero point zero six seven one one inch power four. So you have J, and what will be the C? So C is maximum distance from neutral axis till outermost, which is D naught divided by two, and that will be equal to zero point five inch. Okay. so here you have allowable sharing stress which is given as 12 ksi so 12 into 10 to the power 3 is equal to torque c is 0.5 divided by j is 0.06711 so from here you will get this torque is equal to 12 into 10 to the power 3 multiply by 0.06711 divided by 0.5 so when you calculate it you will get torque will be equal to 1610.68 and it will be the unit will be in pounds into feet so the unit will be pound into inch not into feet because every value is in inch c is inch j is inch power 4 so we will get this now we will convert this torque in t is equal to 1610.68 pounds and 1 inch is equal to uh, 1 over 12 feet 1 over 12 feet so torque will be converted into 134.22 and now unit is pounds into feet why we have converted it into pound into feet because we have been given as power as 20 horsepower and we know that 1 horsepower 1 horsepower is equal to 550 pounds into feet per second so 20 horsepower will be equal 20 into 550 which will be equal to power will be equal to 20 into 550 will be 11000 and unit will be pounds into feet per second now you have uh, 
this power you have the torque clear so you can just put it in this formula so let me put it omega which is angular velocity is equal to power divided by torque that we have written over here so power is 11,000 divided by torque is 134.22 so when you solve this you will get angular velocity is equal to 82.0 radian per second so minimum angular velocity is 82 radian per second which is the answer of this question and that was all about this problem 5-34 i hope you have enjoyed this video and you have learned from it those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and press the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest videos if you have any question you can ask me in comment sections thank you for watching